What's going on, guys, and welcome back to the first ever FIFA 20 Nautica Vice Cremade brought to you by me. I'm back with a Cremade video. I know a lot of people have been asking for it, and I'm here with none other than Sabri Lamucci. We will move, we will take Forest up until the highest of heights as long as it's possible. Um, uh, but there's a few rules we need to go over first in the series. Rule number one is that we have to sign at least three youth players from the youth academy every single season. Whether they're, I use them or not, I have to sign them into the squad. And they have to be competitive in the squad. Obviously, I'll train them and stuff like that to get them as com competitive as possible. But, yeah, that's one of the rules. The second rule is that we will have to... Um, only use players with a real face in game. So, e.g., Graben has one, um, Lolly has one, and then there's obviously tons of Premier League players that have them. But we have to use players who have real game faces. So, yeah, they're the two rules. Here is the career mode. Obviously, top left, you can see we have Sabri Lamucci. Most of you lot that will be watching will be Forest fans. So, I don't really have to go through the squad too much, but. Just a quick recap, these are the players we have on offer to us this season. Now I do look at selling some of these players, I do look at sending them out on loan. I look at buying players and obviously the youth team with the rules. Now I'm going to quickly just set the team up quick of how I want it to be played basically when I play. Um, and by the way, every episode I'll be playing two games and simming two games just so the episode moves quick, uh, so the um, series moves quickly. But yeah, but before we get into any games or anything like that, or any transfers, drop a subscription subscription to the channel if you're new. Like the video and comment below of players we'd like to say. And remember, they have to have a real face in game. Now this is the team that I will field. While obviously we have these players, we are going to add the add to this team, like I said, but. At the time being, this is the team I'll start with. So Sam Bringo, Cashew, in my opinion, has been the player of the season for Forest this year. Figueroa, Warrell at centre half, Ribeira left back, the Terminator in boots, Mr. Sam Bissell. Sunny DM with Mr. Perfect this season, Ben Watson. You know he's in the team. Uh, Tiago Silva, big lad Sammy Amiobi, and the poacher grabbing up top. The bench I'm using is Da Costa, Semedo, Carvalho, Yates, Dawson, Darrick, and Smith. And the players that miss out are these players, but don't worry, they will get the chance, and I'll try and keep the squad happy. Oh, and by the way, here are the screens that will show the um, stats at the end of the season. So I'll pick my player of the season. You'll pick your player of the season. You'll pick the goal of the season. I'll pick my goal of the season. And we'll see where we are, and all that will be over on my Twitter. So if you go to my YouTube channel and click the link, it will be there. It will be in the link in the description below. Or you could just go to Twitter and type in at jackinger underscore, and it will be there. So uh, if you go to my Twitter, at the end of every season, there will be a poll up there. I'll tell you in the video when the poll will be released. Like I'll give you a certain time and everything. We vote for it, and I'll make it like an end of the season video. And... Like he's the, here's the list you'll see at the end of the season, and I'll also put like the stats on there, like how many goals we scored, goals against. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Um, player of the season, young player of the season, goal of the season, who got the most assists in the season, who scored the most goals, just stuff like that. You'll see it when it's on screen in front of you. You'll see what's on there. Um, but yeah, that will be the list I'll bring out <coughs> in its own video right at the end of the season. I'll do that continuously by every season as well, as long as we go quite far. And the aim here is just to add a third star to that Forest badge. When in Europe once again, I'm not talking Europa League, we want Champions League. I want to take this team, if I can, to the Champions League final and win it. But we've got work to do. So, um, let's jump into the training quickly here. We'll chuck Tyler Walker in. He's, at the minute, going to be a decent player in the future for us. Um, who do we want to train here? We'll give Alex Might a go. In fact, no, 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 no. We will, oh, no. 
yeah and obviously the uh, real phase rule is only there just because it makes the uh, career more realistic if you want me to scrap it then or be it tell me down below comment down below and I'll, I'll scrap that rule I just thought it was quite a good rule to be for it to be realistic uh, well, obviously some of these players in the first squad don't have in-game faces and I get that but it's just one of the things it would make it more realistic but if you don't want me to then perfectly fine but the one rule I'm sticking with is the uh, youth academy rule here are the five players I'm going to train for most of the season if I can as long as they don't get injured and stuff um, but yeah let's start off with the first rule straight away um, you staff let's get one in so we have 18.9 million to our name so money's not really an option uh, like a problem for us at the minute and by the way I'm only going to send one scout out every season and it's going to be England every time if you want that to change then comment down below uh, where else I should sh send them but I'm only going to have one scout because then, then you can like keep on top of um, everything in the youth academy now if you've got any suggestions for the series how we take it forward uh, and just whatever you th feel and think drop them below I'll have a look and I'll get back to you on them basically but they're the rules at the time being this is the squad you've seen what I want to do and stuff I've told you that we're going to play two games and I'm going to simulate two games every single episode there's going to be an end of the season award show um, but yeah I just need to tell you that I'm basically back and here's the first episode in this episode I'm only going to play the uh, West Brom game to start the season that way I can just see your view on the career mode and stuff like that and we can get the transfer window in after the West Brom game from the transfers you suggest. So yeah, let's move to the West Brom game. 